Hey, what's up everyone? My name is Supergeek and today we have Google Pixel 3a for the gaming performance review. We're going to play PUBG and S49 on this smartphone and see how well the latest Snapdragon 670 processor can handle the high-end gaming. Stay tuned. Google Pixel 3a is a trimmed down version of the Google Pixel 3 which Google released last year. Google kept everything similar in the smartphone except for the display, the performance and the battery part. The Google Pixel 3a comes with a 5.6 inches display. It's an FSD OLED display but it comes with really thick bezels on the top and the bottom part. It is powered by a Snapdragon 670 processor. It's a 10 nm processor which Qualcomm released recently and Google Pixel 3a is one of the few smartphones which comes with this processor. So let's start the gaming performance review of the Google Pixel 3a. The first game which we are going to play is PUBG and before starting the game let's take a quick look at the graphic settings of the game. The graphic setting is set to HD and the frame rates are set to high. I have also enabled the anti-aliasing and the shadows. Now we're in the plane and the frame rates are stable 30 fps. It's not fluctuating at all. Even after jumping from the plane, the frame rates are 29 30 fps. There's no problem there. But when I reach the ground, I can see that the game is not as smooth as it should be. 30 fps is fine, but the gameplay is not as smooth as. I expected from this smartphone. As you can see, even when there are so many enemies rendered at the same place, you can see the frame rates are still 29-30 FPS. They're not fluctuating at all. I can play the game without any problem. But the gameplay is not as smooth as I expected from this smartphone. So it's been 20 minutes in the game, I'm still playing the same match and the temperature of the phone is getting really high. It's not like it's burning my hands but I can notice the back of the smartphone getting really hot. Even at this temperature, the smartphone is keeping the frame rates really stable. I'm still getting 30 fps which is not bad at all. Now let's move on to the second game which is S49 and before starting the game let me show you the graphic settings 
the graphic settings are set to high and let's start the game so as you can see the frame rates are 30 fps at the beginning but i can easily see that the frame rates are fluctuating between 20 to 30 fps At some other graphic intense parts of the race, I can see the frame rates going down to even 21 FPS, which is not a good gaming experience. Now to summarize the gaming performance review of the Pixel 3a, I should say that the smartphone is not built for gaming, like you can play PUBG but for 40,000 this is not the best PUBG experience you can get on a smartphone. So if you want a smartphone which can give you better gaming then this is not the smartphone you should go for. You can buy OnePlus 60 or Asus Zenfone 5G which comes with Snapdragon 845 processor and will give you better performance than this smartphone. So that's it for now guys, hope you liked the video, hit the like button, get subscribed and I'll see you in the next one.